Hey guys, welcome to another video. Have you ever wondered how is it that you could possibly find four of a kind? Now, finding four aces, anybody can kind of do that, you know, but uh, what about finding odd cards? What about finding indifferent cards? I want to show you something that I do when I have at least four different spectators. Um, grab a deck of cards and uh, I'll show you what I mean. I have four different spectators and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to ask each one of those spectators to look at a card and select that and I'm going to ask each one of those spectators to select a card, look at it and memorize it. Okay, Each single spectator will memorize a different card. Okay, Run through the deck and uh, let's just select four random cards. Okay, Four random cards one for each spectator one for each okay i'll take the first card spectator number one chose that card i will show spectator number one that card spectator number one will memorize that card okay take that card and put it somewhere in the deck you can see that it is there spectator number two they'll look at their card memorize their card spectator number two memorizes that card that card goes into a different place in the deck spectator number three will look at his card he will memorize his card i will put the card somewhere in the deck spectator number four looks at the final card memorizes the final card this was his free choice i'm going to go ahead i'm going to take that card i'm going to put it somewhere into the deck so four different spectators four different cards they all get put back into the deck the deck is squared up the deck is cut and of course after that we need to give the deck a thorough thorough shuffling of the cards so we're going to go ahead and we're going to shuffle the cards and i want you to see that it is in fact a very fair and very thorough shuffle Notice how the cards are very, very fairly, very fairly shuffled, okay? Now, after we've shuffled the cards, we of course have to cut the cards. And here's what I'm gonna do. Four different spectators, four different cards. I will find all four of your cards, but I'll do something else. I'll find the four aces as well. So that's a total of eight cards that I'm gonna find. Four randomly selected cards plus the four aces. Okay. Now, where is the first card? Well, I know exactly where the first card. I just have to cut right to it. And I know exactly where that first card is. Now, what was that first card? The Jack of Spades. I'm hoping that you're remembering the cards that I showed you. The Jack of Spades goes right there. And uh, right now, all I have to do is simply cut the deck into three piles. And I know exactly where I have to cut in order to find the next card, uh, spectator number two card, the four of spades. Of course, the four of spades. Four of spades. <clears throat> I will take that four of spades, as you can see, and I will put it right here in the pile next to all the other cards. Give the deck a couple of shuffles let's give the deck a couple of cuts and uh, here i'm going to be looking for the um, other spectators card third spectators card um, do you remember what was that uh, spectators card seven of clubs of course it was the seven of clubs look seven of clubs in it goes okay uh, this is going to be a little bit more tricky uh, i'm looking for the last card here it's just one one uh, card, one card to go, okay? One card to go. Uh, what was that? What was that one card? Let's see. Uh, seven of diamonds. Seven of diamonds. Excellent. Seven of diamonds. I'll take that seven of diamonds and I'll put it right there. 
Uh, now, with any luck, one cut is all I'm going to need in order to find the four. Oh. Okay. The cut was here. That was where the cut was. And, and I will find the... Okay. Um, I know what happened. I know, I know what happened. You know, I, I, for a second there, I thought I messed up because I'm looking for the aces. I mean, it's clear that I found all your cards, uh, but I, the aces, you know. Uh, but you see, I'm, I'm so good at this that sometimes I just work off of muscle memory. It's just a pure, pure muscle memory. And uh, that's the reason why the four aces uh, were there all along it's just crazy how it works i mean when i'm that good when i'm the best in the world when i have just elite level uh sleight of hand it just happens on its own you know i i didn't even realize that i was doing that that's just how good i am it's just, i didn't even notice that you know i had put the four aces there uh, but anyhow uh that's something that i like to do when i have at least four spectators uh, it's uh, it's really cool. Gets great reactions, and uh, hope you like it. See you next week.